First, though, a Springdale City Council member is taking some heat tonight after remarks he made on a live city broadcast were considered racist by some people. Thanks for joining us here for your 5 News at 6. I'm Erica Thomas. And I'm Darren Bob. 5 News reporter Catherine Gilker tells us what was said and the reaction from the person he was talking about. Catherine? The comment Little Mexican Lawyer was made by Springdale City Councilman Rick Evans just before last night's City Council meeting started here at City Hall. Evans was talking about his opponent for City Council and talking with a friend and didn't know their conversation was being broadcast live on the city's website. Evans has, has since issued an apology. Listen to what he said. He's already got Facebook pages going and everything else. Some little Mexican lawyer. Be real liberal. That's his biggest problem. Yeah. Those remarks are being made about attorney Kevin Flores, who announced last week that he will run for the city council seat currently held by Evans. Concerning, it's disappointing, and it's it's unfortunate that um, this type of behavior is allowed in City Hall. Councilman Rick Evans declined to go on camera, but did release an apology saying in part, there is no excuse for my actions last night, and there are not enough words to express how truly sorry I am. Flores says he was born in El Salvador, but has lived in the United States for nearly 30 years and is now a U.S. citizen and says he's a qualified candidate for Springdale City Council. I served in the Marine Corps for six years. Uh, I did a tour in Iraq. I served in far off places such as Pakistan as well. Uh, these are words at the end of the day, and they don't harm me. Uh, I'll be fine. Uh, it's just a, a broader issue with the community. But... Um, I don't need an apology. Mayor Doug Sprouse says he is disappointed with the remarks made by Evans. He says the city is not defined by the words of one person, but the people who live in that city. If as a city we are judged and defined by the policies we pass, by the policies we implement, uh, I think that uh, I think that we'll we, we make it very clear that we welcome all, we respect all, we treat all equally. And that's what we can that's what we will continue to strive to do. Flores says he is running on local issues that affect the local community and economy. This just points to a broader issue in the city and the need for more representation, the need for more candidates of various backgrounds to run young, old of any sort that just have something different to bring. Mr. Evans went on to say in his apology that his comments were a severe lapse in judgment and not of a reflection of who he is or how he views Mr. Flores or the Hispanic community in Northwest Arkansas. He says he has reached out to Mr. Flores to apologize. I'm live in Springdale covering news where you live. Catherine Gilker, 5 News. And Councilman Evans's apology, he also says he wants to apologize to his colleagues on the City Council, Mayor Sprouse, and to all of his constituents. He asks for your forgiveness and can assure his friends and neighbors that he will learn from this hard lesson and do better moving forward.